This bicycle basket has a mechanism that is supposed to stop it from sagging down, but it's not very effective and there's a lot of leverage on it, so I think it needs a strut. One could put a well, support down to there or to there, going up there, across and down perhaps, but I think I'll just put a little strap across here or from there and up. I'm going to use a bit of an old aluminium aerial, TV aerial. Um, it's very lightweight, strong enough for this job. So I'm going to squash the end. There's already a hole pre-drilled there um, as I found it. I'll cut it short and use that as the strut. Now I noticed that where I crushed that it actually has split the aluminium which I think is quite handy um, because what I'll do here is uh, split this between the two lines. I can cut, cut this here and fold it there and split it and have one part going up and one across. Okay, can you tighten that up? You need quite a lot of force. Hang on. I bolted that strut on. I had I removed the um, unclipped the caliper brakes to get access. Don't forget to um, clip this back on before you secure the top, uh, so that you don't get it all the wrong way around and have to undo the brake cable. So that's in place there. Of course, it's attached to the fork, not to the frame, so that uh, when I turn. It doesn't um, bend everything. In there, it's not exactly straight, but I think that's good enough. I'm going to now attach that with a reinforce. Instead of a washer there and a washer there, I'm going to put a little strap there. Um, I'm going to use a reinforcement plate and uh, drill through and put pop rivets or blind rivets in there. So that's the job done. I did find that the riveting was quite difficult there, so. I did use a, a bolt. Um, one problem with this is obviously you can't remove the basket as easily as you used to be able to. Uh, in this case we never need to re remove it but if you would need to you could just undo that every time. And I don't need that uh, handle either so we can take that off. One possible they, problem is they, uh, metal fatigue on this uh, weak one. aluminium. It's not a very good, Wait, it's not very strong. Up. So you might want to do it a bit stronger than that. Okay. Otherwise, I think that's a, a pretty good job. Strong.